Hamilton with ProSpot demonstrating the PR5 riveting system. This is for putting in self-piercing rivets is one of the functions. I have a self-piercing rivet here. These are used on uh, aluminum vehicles all over. Um, and uh, here I have two pieces of material, a thin piece that will be the outer body skin and then a thicker piece for the inner body skin. And we're going to join those together with a self-piercing rivet. Again, no hole required. This gun can produce 11,000 pounds of force between here to push this self-piercing rivet right through the material. And it'll pierce through the first layer, and then in the second layer, it will do a forming operation on the back side and create an interlock to hold it together. So, you come in and pull the trigger. We're a battery-powered unit, no tether to any kind of cable or anything. And I'm just gonna push this rivet, and I'll go and join material right together. And here we have the head of the rivet and the back side is uh, formed on the back side here. We have a completely waterproof joint that's been formed. Okay. The other thing that the tool can do is uh, we can quickly change to different size arms. So from a smaller arm up to a larger arm if we were to need more reach in a, in a space and even uh, very large arms that we have. So, and then, not only can we put in rivets, but we can remove them as well. So just by changing the die set here to a different uh, tool, I'm going to switch this over to removal mode. I put the removal tool on this side, and then um, I'll just use the larger arm here, which has the male side of the removal tool. This is our new uh, high-duty uh, high version of the removal tool. Let's throw this nut on here. And so if you were to remove a panel, you'd have to remove a whole bunch of rivets, which are very difficult to remove with a drill or other method. But this tool can use uh, the removal tool to just push the rivet right out. So it lines up by uh, hooking onto this area here. And then if we push the button and the rivet will get ejected. There's the rivet that's been removed, and then I just retract, and now the panels have been separated, just like that. Final thing is we can change this tool from a high force pushing tool to a tool that can pull and install uh, blind rivets. So everything here has been pushing and, and clamping materials together, but now with the uh, pull adapter. You can put this on. Just tightens up. Doesn't require any tools. You can just use uh, hand to put the device on. And now we have a pull adapter tool for pull, for blind rivets. And the nice thing about this is it can pivot in many different directions. So if you have some hard to reach spaces to get into, uh, you can get to any angle and install one of these pop rivets. Um, and I'll just install one real quickly here. Here we have a structural blind rivet, which requires quite a bit of force to pull. And uh, I'm just going to put it in this, this hole here. And we're going to insert it into the tool, pull the trigger, and it compresses that, and then ejects the mandrel like this. So we've done this uh, structural blind rivet. And that's our PR5 tool. Thank you. Thank you.